There are things in this world that we'd rather not think about. But for some people, that's not even an option. Meet little Billy. Billy wasn't always like this. He used to be sharp, witty, like you and me. But then something happened. Billy joined the workforce. And he's not alone. As we speak, business people everywhere are battling a mysterious psychoneurological condition. One that can only be described as disturbing. Donna was employee of the month just last month. It now seems so long ago. Six months after Sarah got her job, she started taking her smartphone into the bathroom with her. Six months after that, she forgot where the bathroom was. They all suffer from IOS, Information Overload Syndrome. IOS affects millions of people across the country. A normal human brain can retain enormous amounts of information. But a business person's brain is attacked by 281 exabytes of quote-unquote pertinent information every year. Exabytes? That's 18 zeros worth of emails, attachments, presentations, voicemails, thought starters, FYIs, and caveats. And it's growing 30% a year. To make room for this new information, the brain is forced to delete all the old data it spent a lifetime compiling. So the very information meant to inform us is actually making us stupid. First, everyday sights and sounds begin to feel unfamiliar. Then muscle memory is affected. Hey, Ed, how are you? Oh, I'm sorry. Finally, survival skills disappear. IOS is highly contagious. In a matter of days, entire companies can fall victim. Be forewarned, the following image may be unsettling. Hey, Tom, come here. You may be asking yourself, what can I do to help little Billy live a happier, more mentally balanced life? The answer is nothing. Billy is five years away from being vested in his retirement plan. He's not going anywhere. He'll be dumb as a box of rocks before you know it. But you can save yourself. Won't you please help yourself? Go to helpios.com and make this a better world for yourself. Billy would want it that way. We think. This has been a public service announcement from Xerox. Xerox, bearing no legal responsibility for information overload syndrome. None.